What's up guys, Little Wolf Max S here, another reaction video. This one's coming from Thomas Cooligan. I think that name's right, Thomas Cooligan. This is International Rules Massive Hits. So uh I'm guessing like is it I can't remember. I didn't really read anything about it. Is it Australia versus Ireland or is it Ireland versus England? I think it's Australia versus Ireland. Not one hundred percent sure, but apparently when they play like uh I can't remember the name of it. I've already done a reaction to it. When they play like their, their soccer where they pick up the ball and all that stuff, they have their own set of rules in Ireland. And then other places, they have different set of rules. So they do this thing where they come together and do international rules. It's almost like a boxing match where each boxer picks out like, okay, I want to fight in these gloves. And then they like debate about it. So I guess that's kind of the way it is. I'm just guessing right here. But uh, if you want to get your video up here, all you got to do is subscribe, comment down below. Let me know what video you want me to react to. I'll put your name on the board. You'll get a shout out and I'll mess with the mic and it'll make a lot of noise. Uh, <clears throat> this video is from Tom McDermott. I believe Tom McDermott. Uh, <clears throat> the band in it is Facing Zero. It says it's an Aussie band with an Irish connection. Facing Zero, the song is all I can see. I'm probably going to get copy hit with copyright stuff on this, which is annoying but I can work through it. I have to file disputes and claims, and sometimes it won't play in certain parts of the world. Uh, so I try to stay away from videos with copyrighted music, but I'm gonna do this anyways. Let's go ahead and get it started. I love that. I love that shoulder charge. I just wanna go ahead and fight. Look at him, they're wrestling. Punch him in the face. Don't punch him in the chest and then look away. What's wrong with you? Those dudes are straight up wrestling. That was not, they were not playing the game anymore. <laughs> I love the dude that crawls out from underneath and sees the ball and he's like, okay. Wow, they're still hitting the guy he's on the ground. Boom. Start punching him. <laughs> Start punching him in the kidneys. More microphone noises. Wow, he is punching him straight in the head. Look at that. I love the shot. Just start throwing shots, man. I love the shoulder charges. Just, if you don't like the dude, throw a shot. Look at that. Let him go at it. There we go. Okay, so it is Ireland versus Australia when you get the international rules. That's funny, dude. Start throwing shots. He's gonna throw it. That dude's throwing shots at anybody he can get his hands on. Referee walks over. Let's calm down. Boo! I think they should stand him up and make him fight. What was that? The dude was like thinking about throwing a shot, but he didn't. Boom, son. You got. Ooh! That looked bad. Boom! Just knocks him off the ball. What is going on? Like, he punched the dude in the stomach. Dude, I bet there's so many fights with the Australians versus the Irish. Boom! My goodness. <laughs> Punches him right in the stomach. <laughs> What's up with the stomach shots? That dude's trying to get, like, full mount. My goodness, dude. They ought to just bring them together and let a brawl just break out. Which I'm guessing is what happens. Wow, he yanked that. Boom, just yanks that dude down. And I love how they're not just excited with the tackle. Like, I tackled him. No, they're going to start punching him in the face. They're like, I tackled you. Now I'm going to beat your face in. You know, it's like, wow. You had a good play on the dude, and then you started punching him in the mouth. Dude, that's awesome. I would hate to be the referees in Australia versus Ireland. Because all they're going to do is fist fight. Look at him, elbow to the face. Boom! <laughs> Over the top! That was like a Superman punch from the top. That was awesome. Look at that. Headlock, punch, punch. <laughs> what is he doing? He's trying to get him like in a Kimura or something. What is going on? It's like turns. It's like they're playing like soccer or football or whatever, and then they just start beating each other in the face. It's insane, dude. 
What was that? He like covered up his head. Oh, get him. Boom. Two players get him. That big dude. Punch him in the mouth. Punch the... That is a big dude. Who does he play for? I can't tell. I'd punch that big dude right in the mouth. Because he went... Like, everybody's like shoulder charging. I guess you're trying to... Wow, you're getting punched in the face. You need to punch back, dude. Everybody's like shoulder charging. Just punch one of them in the mouth. If you're going to shoulder charge somebody like that, go ahead and punch... Get it over with. Punch him in the mouth. Dude. It's seriously just a brawl. Like it just turns into a big fist fight. But see that? They're, like that dude's not just excited to get a tackle. It's like, oh, good play, man. Wait a minute, guys. I'm not done. I got the good tackle on him. Now I'm going to punch him in his face. Bop, bop, bop. You know, it's like, my goodness. They're not just excited with a good play. They got to start punching each other in the mouth. Let them fight. My goodness, dude kicks the ball and gets smashed. What was that? He was like celebrating or something. And then got smashed in the face. My goodness, that clothesline. What is up with the shoulder charge and stuff? Punch him in the mouth. I guess that's what they want. They want the other guy to get penalized. So they do the shoulder charge until one of them throws a punch. Then they, they let him get penalized. Dude, this sport looks so violent. My goodness. That dude hanging. He just throws him off. Get off me. <laughs> <laughs> Punch him in the face again. Dude, I bet you go into this match just like, all right, guys, get ready. And you just walk up. Like, bah, bah, bah. And people are like, hey, we're trying to play ball here. They're like, no, nah, we're trying to beat each other in the face. Man, that clothesline. My goodness. That looked like something out of a cartoon, dude, or, or like an anime. Now he's fist fighting with the other dude. He's taking on everybody. He's just punching anybody he can in his own team, the referee. His mom walked out on the field with a cake. He punched her in the mouth. He's just punching anybody who gets near him. <laughs> My goodness. Wow. I can't believe he stayed on his feet there. My goodness, dude. It's, it's seriously like... You can't even play the sport because you're like, all right, somebody's going to punch me in the mouth. It'd be like you're Tiger Woods golfing and some dude just walks up and punches you straight in the jaw and it's part of the game. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to concentrate on golfing. That's crazy. Yeah, there's the dudes, the music, facing zero, all can see. Even me giving them all the props I can and all that, it's still, the, I guarantee you the video will still be stopped, copyrighted, all that stuff. And I'll have to sit there and fight it with YouTube. Blah, blah, blah. These are my problems. These ain't y'all's problems. But uh, Thomas Cooligan, really appreciate it. Is it me, or were they kind of being like more Australian? Like whoever edited that video seemed like... Um, it was kind of pro-Australia because all you saw was a lot of big Australian hits. You saw some big Ireland hits, but not as many. Sorry, I probably just started World War III, Australia versus Ireland. They're like, no, the Irish kill the Australians. And the Australians are like, no, we murder you. I just started a war, and I had nothing to do with it, guys. Don't come to my, fa my house and start punching me in the face. Especially if you're like, hey, Luna, catch this ball. And you throw the ball to me. I'm like, okay, cool. And you have one of your buddies just punch me right in the side of the face while I'm trying to catch the ball. That's what that game's like. It's like trying to concentrate on this ball while somebody's just beating you in the side of the head. That's insane. The international rules looks pretty crazy. I want to watch it, dude. Uh, that's what it is. Uh, wait a minute. 
I, I forgot what the sport's called. This is live. I don't edit these videos. This could basically just be live. What's that sport called? I know hurling's one of them, but what's the other sport where they have the soccer ball, but it's they, they can pick it up and they beat each other in the face? Dude, that internet. Y'all let me know the next time an international rules match is coming up. Do they do it once a year or do they do it all the time? Because that would be awesome. Here's a comment from Mark K. Aussies thinking they're hard in this sport. Professional athletes against part-time players. Aussies train in boxing as part of their job. You don't see them acting that way against our professional rugby players or our boxers. Huge country towards our little country and still are nothing to us. Simple. <laughs> I guess that's like an Irish dude kind of jabbing at the Aussies. So he's saying that the Aussies are professional athletes in this sport. And Ireland, I, I know Ireland has the county thing where you can only play for your county. I wonder if they take the best players for international rules out of the sport and then combine them to make a team. And it also says Aussies trained in boxing as part of their job. I don't, I mean, if that's part of, part of the sport, I guess it's, it's hard if you have professional athletes who that's all they focus on is this game versus guys who I've been told with hurling and all that stuff, uh, the guys, they, they have jobs, and part-time they play hurling or, or handball. That's what it is, G Gaelic handball. That's what this sport's called. Sorry. Uh, but, like, it would be like me doing these YouTube videos, and that's why these aren't, like, professional quality because I have a job I have to work. I actually have to go to my job here in a couple hours. I have a job I have to work, so I can't focus 100% on YouTube. So what you get of me is real. Like, I just sit down. Press play and boom, we go with it. But um, that's crazy. That the are, is it true? Like I need some Australian people to let me know. Are the Australian handball players are they professionals who go and play the Irish players who have actual jobs outside, or is it kind of the same? Both of them have jobs and they play this sport part time, and then they come together and do international rules. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comments down below what's going on behind the scenes because I got to know now. But, I mean, it just looks like one big MMA fight with a ball in the middle. It'd be like having an MMA fight and just randomly throwing a ball in there. And nobody cares about the ball. They're just beating each other's face in. Thomas Cooligan, I appreciate that. That was pretty freaking sweet. That was an awesome video. Uh, if you want to get your name on the board, all that good stuff, all you got to do is subscribe, comment down below, let me know what you want me to watch. But, y'all, for real, comment, let me know what was going on with all that. There's got to be some real, like, behind-the-scenes type stuff with the Irish versus the Australians. But appreciate y'all watching. Check me out. SoundCloud, Instagram, Twitter. And like always, check me out on the streets.